Hey guys, on gaming back with you, and it is D3 launch day. But we're gonna bring you an episode here. Whoa, switching my map here a little bit of uh, Crusader Kings 2. This is the Alliance map, isn't it? If my relationship. So when we left off, we made our claim for king, and we smashed down this guy first, and we imprisoned him. So that was cool. So we have options, um, and we're waiting this guy out, because he doesn't like us. And if you remember the Dublin guy, I kept him in jail for a little while, and he eventually liked me, but then he went back to not liking me. I could ransom him off, and that's not a terrible idea. I could marry his daughter to like one of my kids or something. Um, but I don't, I don't know exactly what I want to do with him. So we will figure that out. We're going to give him a little time to rot in jail. Most likely, what we're going to do diligent on cost. Huh. Never seen, haven't seen that one really before. We're going to keep him in jail for a little while and then just see where we go um, from there. So he's a pretty good guy except for he has absolutely no diplomacy. Maybe that's just because he's in jail. Not sure. What's this? Lunatic? He's Stark Raven Mad. You know, I don't want you ruling a, a county in my kingdom then. So we might just keep him in jail forever. We will see. Not sure. All right, let's unpause it, play. And do we have any intrigue going on? Um, yeah, we, you, you are not backing her. Uh, stop backing plot. The plot against, with her, against me. Yeah, stop backing that, or you will go to jail, fool. I'm not dealing with that, uh-uh. Ty Cornell's been so blah blah, he likes better. Yay! Pause. Vassals. Whoa. Alright, so St. Bridget really likes the Pope. Makes 12, makes 10. All my vassals have lost a lot of opinion of me recently. Why is that? Why do my people like me less right now? Let's see. Short reign. Oh, it's because I just recently increased the crown authority. That'll go down in a little while. So yeah, we're good. Our taxes are going to be a little lower for the time being. But that's okay. So let's work on the one who likes me the least of Kells. So I'm brief day. Oh. Go here. Nope. Go here. Can't move him yet. We're gonna have this guy come back and help us out. Some of our our loyal-ish followers. So, and not him. Okay, the Earl of Ossory. This is right here. So we want you. If I can get you to come back to improve di diplomatic relations here. I need my people to like me for some, you know, less revolt risk kind of thing. And they should get o over me changing the crown authority fairly soon, I would hope. Uh, accept your demand to stop backing that plot. That's good. We're going to have to keep our eye on this because right now we're not the most favored man in the kingdom. Ooh, hold a grand tournament. 200 gold. Not even close. I can do that now that I'm a king, I think. No. Oh, it's because I have enough prestige now. No. Whoa! Look how much prestige I have and how much I get a month. It's because I'm a king. Uh, Duke. What? What? He took a title from me. What title? Duchy of Meath? Isn't it's these two, right? Hold on. He will not like it if I did that. He likes me. I do not like him. He usurped a title from me. You know what? I should make him a court jester. 
Oh, I do have more titles I can give out now that I am a king, which is very handy. So, like, for example, down here, um, this child who I am educating, he should be educated by me. Can I educate him? This him? Yeah. So I could myself educate him. So we'll do that. And he's currently accepting or reviewing that offer. So, you know, I don't know what I think about this guy doing that because I kind of want my capital to be in Dublin still. Like, it will eventually be the strongest one on the island. So, what can I do about that? Hmm, what would happen if I revoke this title? That's what I want to know. I mean, basically... Um, his opinion, your vassals will not object. Uh, what's my troop status? Because here's what's going to happen, is when I do this, he is going to rebel. 100%. And it's a bad time right now, because this guy might rebel. This guy can't, he's in jail. You know what? We're going to... Duchy of Uster. I can make this claim now. I do not have the money. I'm thinking I'm going to get rid of this guy too. I think it's time. I think it's time, guys. Let's save it in case things just go horribly or... You know what? I haven't done anything yet. So, we're just going to do it. Look, dude. You want to become my chancellor? How good are your stats? Yeah, you suck. You're getting it. You're just getting it. In a way, you don't want to get it. But I'm taking that title back. Punk? Yeah. Yeah. I did that. Uh, may your humors rot in your living body. I will not allow you to steal my titles out of fight. You are no longer my lord. Oh, really, fool? You ain't got a chance. You see my armies? My armies are amazing. Uh, I gladly accept guardianship between... Yeah. Alright, so, um... Yeah, I'm heading up this army, and we're coming in. Oh, you want to siege me? It ain't gonna be like that. Uh, he's called for... So he's called this guy into the war? Bad idea. Yeah, so Duke Brian the Cruel of Munster. You're fat you're fighting uh my courtier, and he's gonna whoop on you. That's all I'm gonna say. It's gonna say something a little more vulgar, but that's just how it's gonna be, we're gonna win. My prisoner is complaining about his dark cell, looking for something more suitable. Um, very well, I should be merciful. I could lose negative five. So I could put him in the oblette, which will lower his diplomacy and... Sorry, dude. By sorry, I mean not sorry at all. And now we're in the combat phase and routed. So here's a tip. Don't battle me, bro. Don't battle me. Two children-like guardians. My daughter? Oh yeah, they're twins. Um...
who should I have train her? Seems like a great one to actually do it. Mastermind Theologian's not great, but he is a genius. He's got great traits and he's ambitious. Zealous would be ideal, but hopefully he inherits Zealous. Yep. Your your son, Little John. So, smack down this army here. And destroyed. Every time my ward... Lose the trait shy. I'll let him be shy. What, I lost a war? Battle, whatever. It's because I wanted to go ahead and move my troops prematurely. And smash that army. Okay. So we're just smacking this guy down for trying to uh, battle us. Now it's phase of shouldn't have even tried, bro. You lost. You're gonna lose again. All right. I'm gonna polish off this army. Nope. Whatever. Uh, who's this? Courier died. Okay. So this war should almost be over. Once we capital is conquer his capital via barony, it goes downhill pretty quick. So if I win, I'm gonna gain prestige, he will lose prestige, and he becomes imprisoned. Construction increase, that's good. Bridges customs, good. I think we're gonna declare war on this guy for what he started here. Sweet, that bishop finally died. My goodness. This one's just about done. We wanted to move him. Let's just check where we want to move him. I see that negative has gone away now. My vessels love me again. Um, well, they're getting there. Still negative 30. We need to work on the Bishop of Ferns. So you go here again. And we're just about to take the barony back. Alright, defenders, blah, blah, fourth unaware, blah, blah, blah. Wow, already a success? You just arrived. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Pause it. Pause it, I mean. So. Bishop Ferns. Okay, so. Not much has changed yet. Or it won't negative, I don't know. Alright, so this guy, my half brother, thinks that he would be a better marshal. Let's check out your stats, bro. 15, 12. That guy's a bishop of mine, now I kind of need him. 
much do you like me, brother? Fairly well. Um, I'm gonna let you do it. I'm gonna marry you off. Let's find you a good woman. Wow. Poet, and she didn't knew it. I don't want his children to be ambitious. Though I don't think they'll be pretender since he's my half brother. So. He needs a wife that's closer in his age. 33 is not awful. Oh, marrying him off could get me. Sam Silver, Rob Tartan is ready to mean. Of course they will use it. So anyways, let's go back to finding him a wife. So I guess I could get um, an alliance out of marrying him off. It's not too bad. I don't want her. Though she's I'm not too old. Some princesses. Castilian. Let's sort him by age. By the way, marry him to a one year old? Nah, I'm gonna pass on that one. This could be a good one. She's almost of age, so we could arrange betrothal. Norwegian? She's got decent stats for a uh, 15 year old. I might go with the Norwegian. Definitely don't want this one. Ooh, the Russian. <laughs> Greek? We're gonna go with this Greek chick. You know what? Ooh, she's Orthodox. That's fine. So he wants to be... whatever. Back to war. Okay. Yeah, he used that claim. Not a good idea for him. Okay. Uh, Likes the Pope less. I'm sure he's saying, it's merely a flesh wound. I'm losing, but I won't give up yet. Well, you're about to lose another holding, bro. Oh, look at that. I don't want it. Alright, so he loses it. He gets imprisoned. I accept. Alright. So let's go to this real quick. Our money is back. Look, we're already back at 200. So we can make our claim for the duchy here. Don't need to do that. I'll make that duchy once I own them all. It should be cheaper then. Um, let's do this. Uh, doo -doo -doo -doo. I can hold a grand tournament now. It's kind of what I was looking for. Grand tournaments um, should help me out. Summer fair, gain prestige monthly. I think I'm gonna hold a grand fair. Again, I'm gonna prestige, plus other stuff will happen. So, I guess I spent my piety whenever I became um, the king. Either way, I should be gaining now. Yeah, one, one piety a month. Massive bonus for being king, I think. Yeah. Anyways. We got two prisoners now. Let's do this. We're gonna go ahead and hold our grand tournament. And let's. I'm pretty sure I revoked the title, right? Um. Why does he still have the title? It cost me 20 piety. 
ransom him for 145 gold? Well, first of all, you're in my jail, so you no longer have that title. So there was uh, no arguing against that one. Since he's in my jail, he has to... Sorry if you couldn't hear me. He has to lose the title. He has no choice. He's my prisoner. He really doesn't like me, but, um, you know, too bad for him. He lost his hair. Um, can I revoke the other title? My other vassals, um, not like that. We ransom him for 70 gold. Execute him. Release him. I'm not doing any of these things. You're gonna rot, bro. So now I should be gaining even more, yeah. We'll let some time pass. We have our marshal doing nothing. So let's have you just research some military tech. You guys can go home. Look how many troops I can have. Oh, man. Oh, man. Uh, he died a maimed cripple. That's fine. Uh, for the next two months. Sure. And actually, I want to do something. I've noticed that your couriers don't tend to marry on their own. So. I feel like she's unmarried. She wants to be. So I can marry her off. I want to marry her within... Prince Little John. Alright, no, let's, um, go to the men now. Need my court to propagate, man. Woman, woman, woman. Marshal, my half-brother. I just wed him off, so he should be fine. Queen Mother of Ireland. Can I, yeah, can I remarry her? Matrilineally. Will anyone give me an alliance? Could get this old man. I should marry her like to a little child. It'd be kind of funny. Um, let's see, 71 year old guy, I kind of want to marry her to like the, like a 16 year old, they'll probably say no, most likely they'll say no, this guy of Northampton, North Northumberland. I'm gonna do it. Oh yes. Matrilineally. <laughs> that is awesome. Matrilineal means he will come to her court. Somehow I gained a vassal. Confused. Anyways. Back to the courts. Um, my queen, she's obviously married. Alright. Where's the men? Are you married? No. Let's marry you off. He's young, he's 16, let's find him a good girl his age. I know that's kind of a boring thing to do right here. But I want to propagate my court without having to spend the money to do so. Cruel. And I want people with good traits. My cur. She's got fairly good traits. So. We're just going to do this real quick. Because I've noticed they don't marry... I don't know if that's a bug, or if I'm supposed to basically approve and arrange all marriages. My half-brother. 
he could get us another alliance. So, like, the Castilian girl. Sure. So... Court... <clears throat> now the women... can't really matrilineally marry them off. And eventually you have a whole lot of women, is what I've noticed. Like, as time goes on, that's all you have is a bunch of women in your court. Because, uh, you know, as the husbands die, more just pile up. So, like, widows and stuff, they just kind of never leave. Uh, chaplains can't marry. Or no, he's a court chaplain. Is he a bishop? Oh, he's married. Okay, the bishops can't marry. That's what I was getting at. I might have to marry some of these women off anyways, like this princess. Um, hmm. Yeah, it does me no good to marry her off, though, so what I don't get. I don't get that. Could I matrilineal marry her? No. Just to my son. And I honestly just don't understand that. Both of her husbands have died. She is an unlucky woman. Alright, we're almost done here. Let's stop goofing around the women. Uh, bishop can't marry. Spouse. Spouse. Okay. Nothing else we can do there. So, shut this. Time back on. All our people are working. Um, I accept we get married. That's great. Okay. They're betrothed. Okay. Let's just double check our people. Uh, there is definitely someone better. This guy would be a better marshal. Not worrying about it. 16. Nope. Nope. Spymaster? Come on, we gotta be better. Hmm. I can make this guy my spymaster. He's 45. This guy looks old. 82! My spymaster's 82? Oh my gosh. He's like way off in Genoa. <laughs> He's been there forever. My half brother loves me. That's a little weird. I can make the Crusader guy my spy master. That would not do me much good. I'm gonna make my bishop my spy master, and we're gonna have you study technology. Oh, why can I only study technology down here in these uh, foreign countries? Right there, boom. Study technology, sucker. So we have, what, four bishops working in our court? No, he's a court chaplain. <laughs> oh, man. Can I have another bishop here? No? I could get this guy. He wouldn't be a very good uh, military leader, but I could do it. I doubt there's anyone better than this guy's 20. Not even close. Okay. Unpause. Sorry. We got a grand tournament going on, guys. Let's go back to our country. So, hope you guys have been enjoying the longer episodes. I had someone request them. I've been doing them um, partly on purpose, partly not. My half brother is FIFA zone to govern. Huh. I don't really want to give you anything because you're my half brother. <laughs> well, let's look at you. You're not ambitious. That's good. I'm going to tell you... You're not ready. Sorry, but you like me a lot. Alright, so the tournament's over, and I gained favor with a lot of people. That's not bad, right? 200 gold, not well spent. 
Alright, he thinks he would be a better marshal. So, 17, no, 15. 17. 17 is better. My brother likes me plenty. You know? Honestly. He does. This guy would be fulfilling one of his desires, so he would really like it. Let's check up here with our intrigue. Now that we are... We could kill our wife, kill some kid, my brother-in-law. Become a paragon of virtue. Uh, there's no longer a guardian. Okay, let's pause it for just a second. What's this ambition? What do we get for doing it? I gain one learning and a hundred piety, and I will be known as the holy. Catholic religion gains some moral authority, and the pope likes me. All my bishops love me. To get that, though, I need 500 piety. And that ain't happening. Now, if I kill her on success, nothing. On success, nothing. That's pointless. On this, I gain a stewardship. Not like the biggest deal, but it's cool. I mean, that one's awesome, though. I wish I could do. I mean, like, you already got 500. What do you, what's that extra 100 really do? We can actually amass wealth, though. That could happen. So I think it's about time to take over another... the land here. Uh, victory is mine. I triumphed several of these for once and for all. That Wow. I gained 100 gold and 300 prestige. I am the champion. So I was crowned the winner of my own tournament. That is awesome. That is epic. <laughs> I've never seen that before. So, all right, I'm the winner of my own tournament. I deserved it. You know, I I clearly was the best. Oh no. Oh, you better not. You better not. I can imprison you for backing this plot. So I won't though. And, yeah, we gotta keep an eye on that, man. They're trying to kill me. These mayors want me out of office. So let's go back to this. Can we tell her to knock it off yet? End plot. Yes, she will end the plot. She doesn't have enough power. Look at all these wars and stuff they're in. Jeesh. All right, he died in the prison. Oops. He died in jail. That was this guy. Now she's in charge. Hmm. I kind of want to arrange, how old is she? 15. I kind of want to make her marry like my son or something. Alright, so we can press claim here to gain this one. I think we will. Du jour claim. And we're going to do that. Send. And let's raise our military. Kaboom. Get it. Uh, bless upon your house, she will finally leave me alone. Thank goodness. Oh, you better get there soon, troops. That little army's gonna lose. There we go. So this guy I brought over, he already left. Victor easy! So we'll just mash down this guy real quick. Be a quick and simple war. Actually, let's make a new unit with my king. Is that me? Yeah. So this is an army of what? 380? Yeah, we'll select that one. And let's do this. 
Someone else died after a period of illness. That's fine. Women dying. That's fine. The king is coming for ya. Let's do this real quick. We're going to switch out who's leading this army. Because I don't want the king to get maimed in battle. So go do it. So, ooh. Yeah, we don't have a marshal. New marshal. So he's currently leading troops. This war will be over very quick. I'm just going to have this guy keep chasing him down. Little victories or victories. I hate how they keep escaping with like... Ex okay, no troops. I was going to say, if he escapes with one troop, I'm going to be so annoyed. Alright, so my army will walk up here. We'll join forces. Already at 200 gold because we won our own tournament. As bogus as that is, we did. Can't merge these. Oh, yeah, I can. There we go. This will be over soon. My liege, people of law, have progressed beyond our own technological level. I've managed to the advanced documents. Ooh. Sweet. He learned something and sent it to us. Good job, man. Who died? Mayor. Fat old mayor. That's fine. 50% should be close to winning this war. Come on, pop up. So I will gain 100 prestige for doing this. It will be over 2,000 prestige. This guy is a very successful king. At age 25, he has 2,000 prestige. His father lived, or grandfather lived forever and never got there. His son was born to someone in Princess Sasha of Castile. That's my half brother, right? Half wit. Good job. Just a hair longer, and we'll have control of this land. Let's uh, check in on this guy real quick. Yes, you hate me. Won't do that. I could assassinate you in jail. That's weird. I could request him to be excommunicated. That's fun. Ransom him. Get another 70 gold. Can't believe I can't banish him. It's ridiculous. Like, I can't do anything other than release him. And obviously I'm not. His heir has to like me more. Yeah, 32. She's like, sweet, I totally will get the car if daddy never comes back. Mm. Alright, once we take this next holding, wheel of one. I do want to get Dublin back. I need to figure out a good way to take that holding back. It's part of my core group. I need it. This is my core group. I think this... These four lower ones may end up becoming the capital eventually, but I don't know. Daughter was born to someone, that's good. Good, have more children. Alright, come on. Technology. Knights Templar, Christian Order founded by a small group of wealthy knights. The Poor Fellows. Wealthy knights, group called the Poor Fellows. Whatever. A little quicker, man. End the siege. You gotta be ready to give it up now, dude. Really? I'm losing, but I won't give up yet. I guess this guy's seen what happened to everyone else I've captured. I stick him in jail and never let him out. Once we conquer this, we will call it an episode. Um... We're going to sit on our gold. We want to hit that amass wealth thing while we're young, and then we'll spend it all at once, basically. Probably. Intrigue. Child likes guardian. Who's this? Princess Least. 
my other daughter. Um. How is she not stressed? We'll send you to our resident genius. Come on. I'm kind of curious on something. Could I marry my twins together? Like, that's obviously gross. But that kind of crap happened. Like, oh, let's just look. Well, that's, yeah, Ankh too. Range Patrol. Okay, I cannot. Okay, I was just wondering because that was gross. Yeah, I can't. Okay. I can probably marry him to, like, his cousins, but not to his own sister. Good to know. It'd be disgusting. Not kidding. Not lying. But I know they've done stuff like that in history. People are weird. And they still do it in, Ken you know, I was going to say Kentucky, probably. But, you know, more like other southern states. You know what happens. You know what happens. Alright, we took that. Are you ready to give up now, guy? Are you ready? Oh, you are? What's this say? We are totally beaten. Yep. You are. You know what, guys? It's like T minus 11 hours till D3 launches. I cannot wait. At the time I'm recording, this is going to be much later when you guys watch it. Hopefully D3 is not a flop. We have won that war. We are now the ruler of this land. Um... This guy actually likes me, even though I just conquered him. So you know what? He's a good dude. I could revoke his title. I'm not going to. What I'm actually going to do is I'm going to grant this guy a title. So what's this one responsible for feast? Nope. Keeper of the swans. Let's look at your stats. You're actually a very good military guy. You're one of my vassals. You m Can I appoint you to be my... Um, I can. I kind of want to. Yeah. There you go. And funny as it is, I'm going to have you research military tech for me. You're going to hate your life, but I'm going to give you a title too. Because you're such a good dude, and you don't hate me after I conquered you, I'm going to give you an honorary title of Keeper of the Horse, which is like a military thing. What it says is, off states all the way back to the Roman Empire and the horse's symbol of power. Still very important. Master Horse delegates the actual day to day running of the stables. Much of the prestige of the office comes from the responsibility. So it's a, it's a pretty good honor for him. He's going to get some money. Hopefully, he can put that into his kingdom. I could make someone the cupbearer, but there's always a danger they will die to poisoning. Probably good to have a cupbearer because if someone tries to assassinate you, it may lower the chances. I don't know. Um, and the sessional is the guy who like organizes entertainment. Keeper Swans is um, like keeper of your your birds. And court jester is someone you don't like him. You make him your court jester. But this guy will be my keeper of the horse. He's become the master of the horse, so he should like me pretty good now. More taxes. And that will be it, guys. Thanks for watching. And if you have any comments, questions, go ahead and send them. Please subscribe, and I will see you guys next time.